Today, we are going to know more in detail about ECCA's remote exams. Also, we are going to take a look on some important frequent asked questions, FAQs, asked by the ACCA students. So, do not miss a single question from the video because it may be one of them which you are having in your mind. Also, do not forget to watch our first video on ACCA remote exam for more details. So, let us start the video. In June 2020, a CCA cancelled their exams due to COVID-19 for the safety of everyone and announced that in September 2020, a CCA remote exams will be conducted, but as we know, the corona still is out of control, and really have no idea how long this can be, and students are worried about their career and wasting their time. Then, the good news announced by a CCA that, a CCA will take the exam from home through a CCA remote invigilation, and can save your whole academic year. They are targeting June 2020 attempt to enable this for on-demand exams that is, applied knowledge and foundation level exams, and September for session based that is, applied skills exams. They are still exploring the situation for strategic professional exams, and they will provide updates soon. Now, let us take a look on some important FAQs asked by the ACCA students relating to ACCA remote exams. FAQ number 1. What actually happens in ACCA remote exam with remote invigilation? Remote invigilation. In this process, you will attempt paper from a room in home alone, and a live invigilator will be monitored to you online. Invigilator will ensure that you are alone in the room, will monitor your computer's screen with artificial intelligence that you are not opening any other window during the paper, or you are not using anything other than paper's window. During the paper time, your invigilator can ask you to talk with him, by this, he will try to determine the circumstance, he can ask you any time to rotate the camera in the room to see if there is any other person has in the room. FAQ number 2, when is remote invigilation being introduced? We are working to introduce remote invigilation in markets that cannot run sent rebus exams due to COVID-19. Remotely invigilated exams will be introduced from June 18th for any exam currently delivered through on-demand. We are looking into how we can deliver session-based exams remotely if center-based exams continue to be disrupted in September and beyond. FAQ number 3. Are remotely invigilated exams secure? Yes. Remotely invigilated exams are very secure due to the checks performed before and during the exam. The exam regulations will be available to students ahead of booking to allow them to familiarize themselves with what they are permitted to have and do during the exam. Once the exam has started, the invigilator will continue to monitor the student for the duration of the exam. They will also be able to assist you with any technical issues that you face. Next, FAQ number 4, what computer hardware requirements students need to attempt a CCA remote exam for a successful paper? For a successful paper, the students should have up-to-date system. Following things should be taken into consideration while selecting your system. First is, your system RAM should be minimum of 4 GB to run the process smoothly. Second is, if you are using Windows system then you should have minimum Windows 7 in your system. And if you are using Apple Mac, then you should have Mac OS minimum of 10. Third is, you should have the internet connection with a minimum 10 Mbps speed. If you don't have above hardwares then a lot of technical issues will happen. Also, ACCA will face issue to monitor you reasonably. Next, FAQ number 5, what if you got disconnected while giving exam? If your internet got disconnected and your exam got discontinued, then a remote invigilator will call you on your mobile to ask the problem, and will try to solve if your problem is genuine. Then he will try to reconnect you to your paper. During the paper, you cannot take a break, you can't go to the washroom. Next FAQ number 6. What will ACCA do with the photographs or recordings taken during the exams? ACCA follows global protection laws, 
rigorously. Recordings and student data will only be used for the purposes of exam-related activity. Information will be provided to students ahead of signing the terms and conditions on how any recordings and data will be used. FAQ number 7. My on-demand center is still open. Can I still take exams there? Yes. Students should continue to take exams at centers where it is safe to do so, that is, their centers are in green zone. The option to take remotely invigilated exams is an alternative to students who cannot access an exam center due to disruptions. FAQ number 8. Will all exams in September be remotely invigilated? We are still planning to run exams in centers in countries where we can. Exam entry is currently open for our center-based exams, so students should book exams as they normally would. If we are advised that centers have to close, we will aim to switch students to a remotely invigilated exam, if students would like to continue on their planned journey, and places are still available. FAQ number 9. Will exam fees will remain same for remote exam taking? Yes. The exam fee will be the same as per normal routine, there is no change, but keep in mind this will be cost very high to ACCA, as this is a very tough process and need much more resources to conduct papers online.